Hey everyone, in this video I want to go over uh, one of the most famous math books out there. It's called Principles of Mathematical Analysis. It's written by uh, Walter Rudin. Uh, this book is so famous, it has a nickname. People call it Baby Rudin. Uh, what's regular Rudin and what's Baby Rudin? So Baby Rudin is this book here. It covers uh, undergraduate mathematical analysis, also known as like advanced calculus. It talks about continuity, differentiability, integrability, sequences and series of functions, etc. Whereas the regular Rudin goes into like measure theory and stuff related to that. So let's talk a little bit about this book and let's take a quick look uh, inside this book. So first of all, note that this is an old edition. Um, I got this book for like $5.50 delivered to my door uh, several, several years ago. Uh, from a website called bookfinder.com. Uh, I always believe in buying used books uh, because that way you can save money. So uh, nothing wrong with getting older versions. Plus, I think older versions are cool. This is probably like the second or the third edition of the book. So one difference uh, between this version and the newer versions is that this book talks about Dedekind cuts. I believe it's Dedekind or Dedekind. Um, I think the newer versions don't talk about this at the beginning of the book. It might be like at the end somewhere, uh, if it's even in the book. So um, Richard Dedekind was a uh, famous uh, logician, and I'm pretty sure he went insane. Um, so um, that, <laughs> so that, that maybe tells you something about uh, how hard uh, this stuff is. Looking through the table of contents, we've got set theory. Sequences in series. Let's turn the page, see what else we got. Up here looks like we have continuity, differentiation, the Riemann integral, sequences and series of functions. This is probably one of the best sections in the entire book, honestly. Um, Rudin does a really good job um, explaining these topics compared to other calculus books. So I think this is one place where this book uh, shines uh, more on um, the theory of series then functions of several variables, and then uh, Lebesgue theory, and that's the book. So one of the things that's uh, challenging about this book is how hard it is to read this book. Um, it's very difficult to read, uh, it's written in a very, very rigorous way, and it really is uh, a mathematical analysis book. Um, but if you actually knew all of the information in this book, uh, you would be a master. I mean, I had a friend, oh, he's still my friend, and um, he went through the entire book and he read it. He didn't do the exercises, but he read the entire book and he tried to prove all of the theorems on his own. It took him an entire summer. He worked on it every single day. Um, he has his PhD now in mathematics. So, um, so it's worth it maybe, right? It's worth the struggle maybe to sit down and just work through it, you know, one page uh, at a time. Anyways, that's it. I just wanted to make a quick video uh, talking about this famous book. So there it is, Principles of Mathematical Analysis.